Yo, what's going on guys? Gonna be showing the strongest Jack Jungle build to carry your games with. You want to go Lethal Tempo, Triumph, Alacrity, Last Stand, Cosmic Free Boots with Attack Speed 80 and Health. First item rush, you do want Sundered Sky. It's very, very overtuned at the moment. Then you're gonna push for Trinity into Spear of Shojin. All these items set you up with lots of damage and ability haste. We're gonna auto E. This guy is on AFK mode. First Blood to Ezreal, cool. That doesn't change the game much for us but it certainly will help out the Ezreal. Jax, you never want to first pick him. They pick a bunch of champions to counter you, so I last picked him. Wow, cool, Ezreal's doing the same thing Seth just did. And for example, the Kindred has lots of autos, Caitlyn autos, Orianna empowered autos, Set empowered autos, and Blitzcrank, his knockup is an empowered auto, all of which we can block with our E. What is going on? Everyone's just choosing to die. This is absolutely bizarre. Auto E. I don't know what's going on here. Everyone's just choosing a death. This is the most bizarre game I've ever played. Mana Potion. Auto E. We block her auto. Got it. Yeah, I don't understand what's going on right now. This is freaking strange as heck. <laughs> but hey, it is what it is. Uh, I'm thinking I'm just going to grab Blue Gromp Reset. Just kind of depends on what Kindred does. I'm very low. We're going to auto E. If you time your E properly, you should be able to block two autos from a monster. The more autos you block, the more damage your E does. Against champions as well, especially if they have kill pressure, you want to use your E right as they're using their auto. So that way they commit to wasting time and you'll do more damage from it as well. Auto W. Yeah, everyone's just griefing right now. There's nine kills already two minutes in. Holy crap. I guess it's late. People want the game to be over already. Just started. <laughs> just started, people. Come on now. Need one more auto. Poof. One more. You can get Q level 2. W is typically a little bit faster for your clears. It interacts with your passive. It's also a uh, shorter cooldown. If you're going to gank level 2, which you should never do on Jax, it's too risky. You're only really going to get the opponent's flash. Now, if you're ganking someone who didn't take flash, who should, let's say they went TP Ignite. It's like a kill top TP Ignite. Sure, fine. But in general, you just really shouldn't. Team Matt items are certainly good on Jax jungle. They're not 100% necessary. Especially with an Emax first, your AoE clear with jungle pet as well. Tends to be decent to our raptors and krugs you see there the raptors were pretty easy it's not like we have e max or anything oh can't quite block two autos i don't know if they dropped the monster attacks because we timed that pretty tight too i'm gonna just finish them off uh i can kill kindred here kindred's gonna be right here i'll wait for her Yeah. All right, I'll take that. Got her with the stun. Got her with an auto W jump. Down she goes. Caitlyn's pretty low. I'll go for her. I don't mind maxing E first. If you want the fastest clear as possible, or I should say the strongest solo potential, W max first is best. But against their team, they're so auto heavy that I really don't mind it too much. Mm, I misplayed that pretty hard. I shouldn't have jumped so soon. I am quite a bit faster than her though. So, well, I say that, but she has boots. So yeah, I misplayed that really hard. All I had to do was hold jump. That's tragic. The fact that Caitlyn has boots already is disgusting. She just rushed boots first. Well played to her. I was kind of fearful she was going to suicide into turret. So I committed a little on the early side there. Oh, well. We'll grab this, this. Yeah, I guess we can't quite get everything that we want. On Jax, you tend to hold on to your warding totem and don't get oracles. Jax and Lee Sin are the main junglers who will... They tend not to really ever get oracles. If you want to take an objective, you just buy a control ward. We're going to go ahead and mute the way. You didn't ping out any useful information. You just pinged out Blitzcrank, Orion, and Kindred. They were all here. Oh, he didn't even 
ping if they use sums. Those types of pings are so <clears throat> unhelpful. Auto W, Kindred bot side. I'm just going to clear towards bot. They might try to start drag. My teammates will probably get Kindred low. Q, auto W, keep our passive up. Down she goes. Lux lives here for sure, even though Caitlyn has red buff. I'll go bot side with my ghost. Ooh, okay. Lux gets the solo. Caitlyn greeted. Both teams are playing pretty greedy, not going to lie. Kindred says blitz on both teams equally. Nice. When we use our E, like I said, it's important to block as many autos as possible. So on the Raptors, I do like jump on them first. Jump, auto, start the E, W, reset. We do way more damage the more autos we block with it. Is Ezra going to scare away Blitzcrank? Let's see. Blitz has tier 1 boots. I don't have any boots. We're going to Q auto D E. Uh, yikes. Blitz flashed. It's a pretty high value flash to get still. I'm going to take this. My ghost is a lower cooldown than flash as well. It's the biggest downside to free boots is if the opponents randomly rush boots, then uh, makes it kind of hard to gank them. Kindred's top, so I'm going to start drag. Auto W smite, might as well. Can't actually block dragon autos, but you can block herald autos and grub autos. And baron autos, kind of funny how that works. It all stems back from long, long ago when Pantheon passive blocked auto attacks and turret shots. And Pantheon level 2 could solo dragon, and they didn't like that. They need to revert dragon autos to be able to be blocked by auto blocks. Like Jax, E, and, and uh, I guess Shen Circle. The only other auto block I can think of. I'm just going to hold on to my E here. Since I'm in neutral territory, Kindred's likely to show up. Just die. Alright, cool. I'm going to get Krugs. I'll be 6, around 8-ish minute mark. Pop this in here. Rengar, Jax. Anyone who can jump over the wall as long as they can see an enemy. That vision cone is a good friend. Blitz is kind of fast boots, but once he's in combat, it's just like tier 1 boots. Caitlyn's tier 1 boots. I still don't even have tier 1s. I'm the same speed as Caitlyn. She's 350. I'm 350. She's 325 base movement speed. I'm 350 base movement speed. I'm going to run up behind. Ezreal's committing heavy here. Got the ER. Auto W. Yes, sir. We get a kill. We get an assist. Kindred has an old blue buff that's... I don't know which one that is. I don't know if that's mine or hers that she has. We could probably kill them right here. We don't want to hit that plant, though. The plant gives away stuff. We'll wait till they get as close as possible, then Lux will snare. I don't think they expect this unless the try was warded, but I think Lux oracled it. A perfect world... Okay, eh... I'm fine going for Blitz or K. It doesn't really matter to me. Oof. Alright, that works though. They're going to miss a bunch of minions here. I have lethal tempo plus passive built up. I want Grom. I couldn't get to Caitlyn anyways. She just popped Ghost. It's so funny seeing even Caitlyn go Ghost Flash. That's the meta. So it looks like kind it was Kindred's blue. You can't gank through that spot. They have full vision. Kindred's in my jungle. I'm headed over. I'll be late. Kindred has tier 2 boots. Lux has tier 2 boots. I Lux's movement speed is probably higher than 325 though. She's probably faster than Kindred. Yeah, 330 base movement speed. Lux is literally faster than Kindred in terms of just raw walking. I'm on my way. But I don't want her to suicide is the main thing. Lux threw that shield really early. I guess I'll just ghost for it. Q. Of course there's a plant. Why not? I'll go for her. Got it with the smite. Auto W. Block the kindred auto. Auto R. Alright. I'm going to max out my lethal tempo here. Or maybe not. Maybe I just have to run. I got wrecked by Blitz Caitlyn and almost died. Auto W. Block the red buff auto. I should be able to heal a little bit off him I think. Dang, he's doing some serious damage though. 
Yeah, Ezreal leashed it for me. I'm surprised he even knew what was going on there. That's funny. Oh, haha. <laughs> Rip, Ezreal. Kindred might come for this red. Yeah, she's dead. Auto W. Get the stun. Down you go, buddy. I'm low. I can't do much here. Blitz doesn't have Ignite. Caitlyn doesn't have R, but still. I kind of want to get that minion wave. That's a lot of minions. Or Lux can get it. Doesn't matter. I'm getting really, 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 really fed. Also need to spend my gold. As long as we're in combat with monsters, our jungle pet heals us like crazy. I'm just trying to stretch out this interaction. They know I'm here. I'm going to back. I'm going to play Draxel Wind Con. I can start stepping in Kindred's jungle whenever I want. I'm pretty far ahead. Jax is already a very solid soloist. So you think, well, he should be in his jungle anyways. The problem is he doesn't typically have the sticking power to get the kill. They can flash away, escape, whatever. And then once you're in their jungle, he doesn't clear as fast as something like a cane to where it's not necessarily where you want to be. Jax is a stronger ganker than he is a farmer. So if you're constantly putting yourself in situations where you're farming or trying to solo the enemy jungler, it's like, eh... Auto W E. I don't care if he gets it. He art for it. I'm not gonna try to save my W to still. There's something right here. I'm faster than her, but she does have jump spam. Uh, so that's kind of low. We could probably just dive him. Q auto. Yeah, we we can poke away at set. There's Lux pokes. I can grab wave. I'm gonna go. W max now. I can get my passive full stacked off these minions. Walk them down. I'll get up off turret. Auto W E. And I walk out. I only jumped in early just because he was so low. I didn't have to save Q. It would have been safer if I walked him down though for sure because I could jump out. Avoid more turret shot. Raptors are oop. Dragon is up. There's a good chance to actually just start dragging here. Got jungle item finish. Nice. Wait, I don't have jungle item finish. What am I talking about? I feel like I got a speed up there. Got an E. Uh, I'm about to walk into Kindred. The way she's walking is making me really nervous, so I'll just stay and push this. Yeah, sure enough, Kindred's there. Not a huge surprise. She's got Kraken Slayer. She's not really behind. She's got a lot of kills. We need to give up this drag. We need to stay. I'm on my way. This might be warded though. He's not a full item. He's weak. He's weak. He's weak. He's really weak. Uh, got with the smite auto. Got my E down. RQ. Nice. Yeah, he's really, really weak. He has played and that's it. Played it and phase HP. No full item. I have Sundered Heal plus my E to block all of his autos. The only, they, none of them can really do anything against me. The only thing they have is Ori R to pull me off of them. But in terms of their damage output, my E mitigates all of them. Almost entirely. This probably would have been a game for Lethality Caitlyn. Even though I don't think Lethality Caitlyn's good. It's just for the fact that... Uh, we weren't going to be able to get that. I don't have Trinity. It's for, just for the fact that uh, Caitlyn ability still hit me pretty much full hog. Versus her autos doing nothing. Her headshots doing nothing. After Trinity, we shall get the Shoujin. After Shoujin, we shall get the Sterix. Frozen, eh, ever since it's nerf, not crazy about it. Plus, like, you're slowing their attack speed. Jax E blocks autos. I don't know. This doesn't seem the best. If you're building it, you're really just getting it for the ability haste. But there's better ability haste items out there like Shoujin or, honestly, Black Cleaver. Even if the enemy team has a big armor tank like uh, Rammus. Oof, this is a bad fight. Kindred's low. Orianna's doing weird stuff. I don't like this. I'm not going to full commit. I'm just going to do a little hit and run. Blitz doesn't have his hook. Auto WR. I'm going to walk you down. Yeah, Blitz can't knock me up when I'm blocking his auto. Down goes the Ori. She felt real tough because she was near her teammates, but... Sugar, if your teammates... <laughs> If your teammates don't actually have anything, it doesn't matter. They're just going to watch you die. 
It's like being in a in an African uh, river, and a crocodile grabs your buddy. What are you actually gonna do? Probably not much. You're gonna leave. That's what happened there. Blitz cranky went to knock me up. It didn't work. And he said, "You know what? I'm out of here." <laughs> <laughs> he swam for the shore. Yeah, Kendra's flaming the blitz for some reason. He's not even doing bad like, compared to the rest of his team. He's in the same ballpark for sure as them. Still haven't finished my jungle item. Most junglers finish it around their level 11. I'm gonna wait for it to end the bush. Auto W. The E. Q auto. Her teammate's coming, I can't kill her in time. So I'll just back off. They have these turrets here. Kendra's two full items. She has way more gold spent than I do there. I was wondering, she felt kind of tanky. It's the 300 health on Trinity. She's probably gonna go for my red. I have to cross over. There's someone on me right now. She's going to my red right now. Cut down my E. She's There's the stun. Auto W. Yeah, she's literally on my red right now. It was so obvious. She ran right at it. Kale didn't cut. Ezreal seems to know what's going on somewhat. I don't think he can solo her, though. Yep. Yeah, he doesn't even realize what's going on. What does Kel have? She's one full item. She's ripping her up. Hey, bud. Close fight. Well played. Uh, what am I going to do? Do I want to back for Trinity or do I want to stay? I'm already over here. I got passive up. I might as well stay for a wave. Pop the E. Boop. Bop. Pow. Smacked him with a W plus R empowered auto. Jax, can you get a full-time support since you guys already have a Blitz Law? I don't get it. I don't even, I don't get what he's talking about. Blitz isn't even doing bad. He's got 13 KP. He has over 50% KP. It's pretty decent for support. To block Harold Auto is not that useful because Harold doesn't do that much damage anyways. You, you just need to block his big swing. The big swings are where all the damage is. Now this stage of the game, it even the big swings kind of irrelevant. I'm gonna keep going W max second here. Kindred is still two full items. Someone's gonna come right here. Got him to smite auto W or blocked his E. I didn't get off my auto. I accidentally canceled it with W. I W too early. Notice how I saved my E though until he tried to knock me up. If I would have eat early, he would have kept moving away. I would have been able to leave them less autos. I'm not going to get inside. It's better for me. Whoa, yeah, what are you doing, Harold? Use your charge. Better for me to just hit the turret instead of wasting that long animation. Alrighty. I'm going to pull off. I can back for Trinity. That would make some sense here. Auto W, pop the E. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna back for Trinity. I don't like this fight. Ezreal stayed for some reason. I was sitting on uh, too much unspent gold to justify staying there. There's also. There's no catalyst there. It's just like a turret, right? It drags up. Why are we applying so much risk? for such little reward greed Lux gets the blitz we can fight it out here I don't need wraps it's not gonna be level 13 I'd rather take a red I think I need to get here though one person on each team is dead so they might try to contest hey set auto E there's the stun Ah, uh, Kinter kind of hurts. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of that damage. Get her with the Q, auto W, R. Got her with the smite to slow, auto W. Two. Got her with the jump. 
Auto E. Oh, I can't get to him. I need to jump out to something. There we go. Cool, 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 cool. Kindred's full health. Just two and a half items. Yeah, she's a pest, man. That was. She's doing just enough. Mm, yeah, she baited Lux Kel really, really hard. I truly, truly, truly don't want to give up this dragon. I need to heal off stuff. Got the scuttle to try to deter them from wanting to take it. I could go trash Kindred. I'll just go do that. She, she lost a lot of health there. She's half health. It should be faster. Auto W E. Yep, full stack lethal tempo. R auto W. Yep. I mean, she's lethal tempo as well, to be fair, but I'm Jax. It's different. I'm full stack passive, full stack lethal tempo. They're gonna give me drag, I'd imagine. They have no choice. I declare Prima Nocta on Dragon. Nobody can stop me. Oh, Caitlyn, you fool. Headshot me. Do it! I was waiting for the headshot so I could catch her, but she didn't bother to auto. She knew. <laughs> she knew I was coming. Yeah, I should probably go Baron here. Oof. That was scary. Boop. Doesn't seem to be anyone over here. Even with that life still, Jax is a great Baron tank. We block its autos. Azrael's tanking for some reason though. What is he doing? Got it. Alright, I'm out of here. Kendra's really, really fetch. She's three full items. People gotta stop giving her these, these kills. She's getting heck of tank, or not tanky, but she's getting heck of fed. She's more fed than I am. She's got ten does. I could, in theory, just stay on the split. It's safer to team fight though. They have a lot of chase down with blitz. <sighs> From here, it really should be Bork or Titanic. I'm leaning more towards Titanic, though, because they lack a true tank. If they had a true, true tank, a big, thick boy, Cho'Gath, a Scion, Zack, or an armor tank like Rambus Malphi, I would get something else, but just kind of want to clear ways. They don't really want to fight right now. Mm, I'm taking a lot of damage. We can't we can't just run them down. They have good disengage if they're not trying to fight us. And then yeah, then there's the blitz issue. I would have died there if I stayed with Lux is the thing. We would not have been able to fight that 2v5. Q auto W. Count the stun. Q auto W R. Smite. Auto W. Block the blitz knockup. Auto W. Oof. Jump to the ward. I couldn't get down my E in time. That sucks. That is unfortunate. Kindred's so fed, man. You got a thousand gold off of killing me one time. It's wild. Tribreaker's honestly not bad on Jax. I'm surprised it's not a recommended item. Slows them, speeds you up. It also... I guess it doesn't give ability haste. It doesn't technically have much on-hit damage. It's more of just AoE. You try Titanic's more so on hit. <clears throat> this is dangerous. There's nothing to fight for over there other than enemy blue buff. Blitz has immense chase down potential. If we're out of position and they have overwhelming numbers or power, 
it's a not a good risk reward. Oh, here's Ori. I might kin oh, I might have the wrong person. Got the Ori flash at least. Cost me a smite. Mm, it's bad. I can't get to them, man. They're just running. They're so fast for some reason. Got it with the smite stun. That's G that should be GG's. Should be. Kel's gonna TP back. That's funny. All in all, their comp is lacking. Lacking something to deal with Jax. And, uh, yeah. We were kind of lucky we were last pick. I don't like playing Jax jungle if I have to pick him before the enemy team's picked at least three of their characters. Oh, nice. All right, GG's. We'll take a look at damage dealt, damage taken, and runes. Looking at damage dealt against enemy champions, we were not the highest. Kindred Shredding from the back line ended up doing the second most. Lux at the most with the poke. And Aphelios at a close number two. I was technically number four damage. Uh, feels bad. It's just how it goes sometimes when the enemies just kind of refuse to fight you. Whenever I move at them, they run away. So all the damage I got is from the lens of them desperately trying to flee. So, yeah, it is what it is. <laughs> Damage taken. We had the most on our team, not the most in the game. self mitigated. We were most on our team, not most in the game. And for runes high value, on all Jax jungle, don't first pick it. Pick it if the enemy team has lots of autos and you'll have a good time. If you enjoyed this Jax jungle video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know what champion you want to see next. My name is Kingsticks. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.